Hi there. Welcome back to another episode of the Other 167. I'm Johan, your host for the day. Have you ever found buried treasure? I'm sure you've not. So let's join Praveen Christopher as he takes us on a spiritual road map to find the only treasure that's worth having. See you on the other side. Welcome to the other 167. This is Praveen Christopher from Bangalore, India. I want you to turn your attention to the parables that the Lord Jesus Christ spoke while on earth in as recorded in Matthew's Gospel chapter 13 verses uh, uh, 44 onwards. The kingdom of heaven is like unto a treasure hid in a field the which when a man found he hideth and for joy thereof goeth and selleth all that he has and buyeth the field. Again the kingdom of heaven is like unto a merchant man seeking godly pearls who when he had found one pearl of great price went and sold all that he had and brought it. When we find the kingdom of God it is like that man who found a treasure hid in the field. So to get that treasure, what does he do? He goes and sells all that he has and buys that field. So along with that field, the treasure belongs to him. I'd like to change this parable on the flip side. The Lord Jesus Christ is that man who came in search of the treasure that is you and me, who were hid in the earth, who were hid in the sin, who were hid in darkness. So what did Jesus do? He spent and gave all that he had in exchange so that he could redeem you and me back to God. Oh, what a love that Father has shown unto you and to me that we should be called the children of God. The Bible says that God, if he has given to us his son, will he not along with that give all that we have, all that we need? Dear brother and sister, are you going through a need? Are you going through a need that is so great? The Lord Father, who gave his only begotten son for you and for me to be redeemed, will he not along with that give all that we need? Let's look to him with thanksgiving for this gift of salvation that he has given to you and to me and say, Lord, thank you, because along with the Son, we have received everything. Let's offer ourselves to him and dedicate ourselves to loving him and to serving him. Father, we thank you for this privilege of being called your children. Lord, we thank you for you are that wonderful man who came in search of these treasures hid in an earth, redeemed us, brought us out of darkness, and translated us into the kingdom of your dear Son. We are grateful for this gift of salvation. We thank you for this privilege. Father, today we come to you and offer ourselves to serve you, to be yours and yours alone. We give you the glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I'd encourage you to click the bell button on that screen and share the video to others so that they will be blessed. God bless you. I believe it was the famous missionary Jim Elliot who said, he is no fool who gives what he cannot keep to gain that which he cannot lose. Just like the man who sold all his possessions just to get that one pearl, I challenge you, I invite you to bring all that you have at the feet of Jesus and lay it down and receive eternal life today. Thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please uh, give, give the video a like and subscribe to the channel. You can press the bell icon to be reminded whenever a new video is uploaded. Uh, you can also follow us on our social media on Instagram and Facebook for more updates and feel free to send your suggestions and feedback on our email address. 
Thank you for watching again and have a great week.